We end tonight with the best kind of children's story, the kind that grown-ups like too. So here now is the story of Kylie and the Duck, told by Steve Hartman on the road. A lot of kids go to the park to see ducks, but five-year-old Kylie Brown of Freeport, Maine, takes her duck to see the park. Snowflake comes here to swim around the pond and then returns when called because Snowflake truly believes that Kylie is his mother and the duck is not alone in this delusion. I'm his mom. But you're not really his mom. Yep, I'm his mom. How did you first find out? That he was a duck? No, that... <laughs> Kylie is unbearably cute. <laughs> And since I never did recover to ask that question again, <laughs> let me just tell you that Kylie first noticed Snowflake's attachment Aww. the day the Browns brought her home last summer. Look, 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 he follows her. For whatever reason, the duck imprinted on Kylie and just had to be by her side, no matter what the hour. <laughs> when Snowflake refused to stay in the backyard, Kylie's parents, Ashley and Mike, say they had no choice but to give him a diaper and make him a house duck. He goes everywhere the ducks are allowed and almost everywhere they're not allowed. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if you've ever had a two-year-old or a four-year-old that wouldn't leave home without its blankie. She, Anxiety. Uh, yeah, she would not leave home without her duck. On, and at that point, nothing's negotiable. Snowflake! Snowflake goes to the beach in summer and sledding in winter. He's been to soccer practice, gone on sleepovers. He even went trick-or-treating as Olaf, the snowman from Frozen. And over time, because they both sincerely believe they belong together. Snowflake and Kylie have formed a bond like most of us will never know. It's special, even at five years old, that I know that that's the type of person that she's gonna be. She really is going to make a great mom someday, mostly because <laughs> she already is. You know, someday he's gonna grow up and go to college. What? Steve Hartman, on the road, in Freeport, Maine. He fits the bill. That's the CBS Evening News for tonight. For all of us at CBS News all around the world, good night.